All right, here with the MVP of the VirginiaPreps.com 10th Annual Basketball Classic, Jalen Jordan. 38 points, setting the new record of this 10-year history event, breaking it by Rajay Bullock, who plays now at Providence out of Kikatan High School. He did it five years ago against L.C. Bird. Jalen, I just asked you, did you have any idea about the record? Did, any idea about it? What do you think? I ain't even know. What was the record again? 31 points. You had 38. I thought at least I had like 30. I ain't, I ain't even know I had 30. I ain't got hurt, so I thought. I told Coach Brown to put me in the game. So I try to score 40, but he let me see out. So. What's it mean for you to get 38 points on 13 of 15, 5 of 5 from 3? You had 26 at the half. How are you feeling? I was feeling very confident. I was hit, after I hit my first shot, I just knew that all of them, all my shots were going to go in. I take good shots. And Paid off for you for sure. Um, what's it mean? I know winning matters most to you, but to get this record and play like you did against a defending state champion, Elsie Bird, do you, do you guys take a lot of pride in that? What's kind of the feel? I knew Elsie Bird was good, so, you know, no one other played defense, so the defense, the defense tires, tires the team, tires the whole team, so mm -hmm. it's worn down, worn down, and all your years of playing basketball, rec ball, AAU as a kid, have you ever been feeling it like you were today? Nah, for real, for real today, like, no. Yeah, for real, for real today, is like, I had more confidence than everything, so, like, I seen one going, so I knew I could be any set, like, I wanted to. Did you sense that their defensive plan was not to leave you open to kind of play off you in a sense? What did you see from them defensively? Most teams focus on DB and Joe, so. They so, couldn't figure the slip out. Yeah, so they can't figure out that, that slip and roll, so. I mean, I just wide open and they swung it to me and I just well, hit the shot. DB gets 29 and 13, and Joe's been pouring it on. He had nine boards and four steals today uh, against a team that was big. How much does this help for you knowing that you could run into a team with size similar to this in the playoffs? I mean, if a team is big, we will just, like, try to double team. But, like, if it don't work, I mean, it just don't work. But. Last two for you. Colleges were in the gym today. I don't know if you noticed that Radford was here and Hampton, Norfolk, some other Division One schools. How much did, is it that you get amped up for having a big crowd and having some of those guys in the building? Well, first of all, I knew because UMass have good, good, they have good contact with me. So UMass, you said? Yeah, UMass. Okay. They said they was coming to the game, so I had to like I couldn't play like down some competition. I had to play up and okay. try to get a scholarship. Sure. Why should a school recruit you? I mean, today they all got to look at the stat sheet and see you got 38 points. You're pretty good, but what would be your selling points to them? Well. First time I'm a shooter, so I can shoot the ball. I, I play defense well on the perimeter. And, yeah. and lastly, uh, what do you guys do from here? Can you use this win today to get you guys even more momentum and confidence? How so? Oh, yeah, we're just going to play outside of play, turn, make teams turn the ball over, and yeah. That's JJ, Jalen Jordan, the new record holder, 38 points, Lake Taylor victorious and still undefeated. Thanks so much. Thank you.